This is my first video of a series that I'm going to do on YouTube. Um, basically sports talk and basically go over um, each person in the SEC schedule. I don't know if I'm going to get to all of them, but I'm going to try to get to all of them and uh, basically predict the schedule and uh, see how good I do. If you're a Tennessee fan, make sure to hit the like button because this video is all about your schedule and how good you're going to do. Okay, you start out with Georgia State, okay? And you know how that went. Y'all didn't do very good. Um, Y'all struggled the whole night and lost 30 to 38, okay? And I know y'all are gonna change that uh, this year, hopefully. Then next week, you went to um, BYU and lost 26 to 28 in double overtime, which last year I thought y'all were gonna win that game, but y'all lost it in the end. Um, then, you face Chattanooga and you got a big win there, uh, 45 to zero. That's a good win. Um, then you went to Florida and got beat um, three to 36, 34. Okay. Um, then you went to Mississippi State. Oh, I'm sorry. You went to F Georgia and you lost um, 14 to 43. Then you got a big win over Mississippi State. I think this is when things started getting a little better for you. Um, y'all had a, yeah, and the next week y'all, of course, faced Alabama and lost, um, 13 to 35, but then after that, you went on a, uh, five-game win streak, um, beating South Carolina, UAB, Kentucky, Missouri, and Vandy, and then you went to a bowl game and, um, beat Indiana, 23 to 24, finishing off with an eight and five record, but here's the thing. If you would have beat those two teams, BYU and Georgia State, then you would probably end up with a with a bowl win. You would end up with a uh, ten and three record, which sounds very good. Um, but let's go over this year's schedule. Okay, you start off. You start off with Charlotte. Okay, you have a winning record against them, one and zero. I don't know. <laughs> um, you only played them one time, and I think you should get a win there. No problem. Easy. Okay, not even a question. Okay, then you play Oklahoma. Okay, it's at Oklahoma. Um, your record against them is one and three. Um, I don't think you, you could beat this team is possible i think it could be possible i'm not saying it's not possible but um you're either gonna get a win against oklahoma or florida i think um but it won't be oklahoma i think at oklahoma i think you're gonna get a loss there all right um Furman is your next opponent i think um you're gonna definitely beat them no doubt um your record is two and oh against them um, you're going to get a win there. Then you're going to go to, uh, then Florida's going to come to you. And, uh, this is where things get interesting. Your record against them is 20 and 29. Okay. You're, they've owned you about by nine games, I think. Um, but it's, it's in your home court, you know, um, Florida, they got, Kyle Trask, you know, he's going to come in there. He's going to be all hyped up, but it's going to be a very loud stadium in uh, Tennessee. And I think, um, I think it's going to be very good for y'all. Um, and I think you're going to get a win here. So most people would not pick Florida to lose in this game. Um, it's going to be upset. I think Tennessee is going to pull off the upset in this game. All right. And, uh, we got Missouri next. Missouri comes to you. Your record against them is three and five. I think you're going to get the win there. No problem. No, no doubt. Um, at South Carolina, I think uh, you're going to get a win there. You know, you, your record against them is uh, 36 and 10. So I think you're going to get a record there. No problem. Um, then um, Bama comes to you. Okay, and you're gonna pick up a loss here. Okay, your record against them is uh, 37 and 57. It's not a bad record against Bama, to be honest. Um, uh, 
yeah, you're going to pick up a loss there. Bama's going to be an unstoppable team next year, I'm pretty sure. Um, then then you're going to go to Arkansas, and you're going to you're gonna beat them. You know, your record against them is 13-5. You know, you've owned them. Um, Kentucky, oh, my God. Your record against them is 76-19. and That's ridiculous. You're definitely going to win that one. Um, no problem about that one. Okay, and then Georgia. Your record against them is 22 and 24. I, I thought they played more than that. <laughs> it seems like you played more than that. Yeah, you're gonna take it. You're gonna pick up a loss there. Um, it's at Georgia. Yeah, I think you're gonna pick up a loss there. Um, Troy. Yeah, your record against them is one and zero. Shouldn't have a problem with them. So you should win that one. And. Um, at Vandy, record against them is 76 and 29. That's ridiculous. Um, you're definitely going to beat that team, which is going to put you nine and three for the season. Now, that is pretty generous coming from a Bama fan, but um, I do see y'all having a good season. It could go south for you guys. You know, you could lose to um, Florida. You could lose to South Carolina. You could lose to possibly Vandy. I don't know. I don't see you losing to any of these teams. Your schedule is pretty – it's not easy, but uh, it's not super hard like it usually is. Um think you're gonna have a good season um it could easily be an eight and four season and then maybe a bowl win nine and four kind of season uh, i think you're gonna go nine and three just my prediction i think you're gonna take a step up and uh be a contender in the uh, east so uh that's my that's my um predictions and uh there'll be more of these videos coming soon